Hey everybody, Tony D and Little Joan here with Screenwriters Rant. Gotta get out of politics for a while. Smash like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Please check out my books, Woke a Santa Novel and Holly Woke, the sequel. Links in the description as well as the Pineys books 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. All available in ebook, trade paperback, Kindle Unlimited is free. Still working on those audiobooks. Now, this is called Life in a Year. And it stars uh, Jaden Smith, Will Smith's son, and I forget her name. Uh, oh, Cara Delavinge. Delavinge? Um, I think she's an okay actress. I think Jaden Smith, uh, I don't think he's a very good <laughs> actor. I mean... You know, he's young, he, he's a sharp-looking kid, but, you know, there's not a lot to him. And uh, it seems like, even in this trailer, everybody's acting around him. Um, but, you know, uh, and it's from executive producers, Mom and Dad. <laughs> And the premise of the movie, it's called Life in a Year, is um, he falls in love with this girl, and she's she you know she doesn't want to date him and is like real gruff, but like it turns out she's dying, she's dying, and she's gonna be dead in a year, and then he decides, well, I'm going to, uh, we're going to live our life in a year, so we're gonna do all the things people do in life in a year. And so that's why it's called Life in a Year. Get it? <laughs> so, uh, you know, I guess, sure. And and he he does all these things, but uh, he's also kind of a rapper. And she brings him to a rap studio so he can get into his music. And she keeps saying, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? Don't live for your parents. What do you want to do? What do you want to do? <laughs> Like, she must say it like four times in the, uh, in the trailer. And it's, you know, they're good looking leads and a love story. And here's, here's his whole thing, you know, where he's going to do everything because she's, she's suddenly dying. And, uh, you know, I just feel like the entire movie's contrived, you know, it's just like, I could hear the pitch and, uh, and it's just. This is the next generation of movie star because, you know, his parents were movie stars. Ergo, uh, he comes in. And this is uh, this is a guy from Wu-Tang, right? That's a Wu-Tang guy. I forget his name. And he's in it, too. It's just, you know, it takes place in Philly, I guess, because Will Smith's from Philly. Life in a year. Uh, life in a year. On on uh, on Netflix in a month, I, I'd say. Um yeah, I just wouldn't have casted J uh, Jaden Smith in a role like this. I don't think he has the acting chops for it. I just don't. You know, I've seen him in other movies. I saw him in the uh, remake of uh, Day of the Earth Stood Still. Is that what it was called? The one with Keanu Reeves? And it was just terrible. He, he was terrible in it. He wasn't even in, in it that much. In my view. And it's just my view. Uh, I think... And, you know, I, I, I got to say this, like, actors and artists, they have to connect with normal people. I don't know if Jaden Smith, who's been, you know, he's been rich his entire life. His parents are world famous, both of them. Um, you know, I've seen his Twitter feed. It's hilarious, but it's also a little like, what's the deal with this guy? Like, he's... He says a lot of crazy stuff on his Twitter feed. So I don't know if he can connect with an audience on a level that makes any sense. Right? Like if it was a comedy, it would be different because he'd be entertaining us and being like a clown. If it was some sort of contrivance, you know, a road trip story with some buddies or, you know, anything that didn't require him to act so human... I don't think this is, you know, from what I saw in the trailer, it just, it just feels hollow. 
you know even even this even this outfit like it doesn't scream to me genuine it's too clean it's it's too nice like you know when they used to make these kinds of movies back in the day the outfit of the main character he would have been you know his clothes would have been a little worn and maybe they wouldn't have been in style or whatever this looks like he just bought these clothes right you know and i think you know he's been rich all his life so he's used to that so that feels right to him but it's not a normal person right like a normal person would have been working in some store part-time or going to college or going to high school or however i don't know how old he is in the movie it might be high school or it might be college and it would have been you know would have had all these details about life i don't i don't see any of those life details here with him it's just his agenda it's just his thing pushing forward the girl kind of has that a little but even the opening scene it's in a like a soda shop where if he tips her she has to sing it's like where is that like where does that exist I, I i guess there's one or two of them around but again it all seems very contrived and forced this isn't a movie i want to see you, you know and uh i i can't imagine it'll connect on um, like an emotional level with people it, it'll just you know people will go see it because Jaden Smith is in it a few people will but beyond that I I don't I don't see the appeal so anyhow yeah uh, he he might be uh, in good shape since movie theaters are closed and He'll just be another stop on the Netflix style. So, I don't know, maybe a few people will watch this, but not me.